Join us and hundreds of other women all over the world diving to celebrate the ocean. And be part of the largest single day of diving action this world has ever seen. Add your events to the conservation activities locator to get involved. And this is how. So go to paddy.com forward slash list now to get started and at this page you can learn all about the conservation activities locator and where you can add your women's dive day activities. So scroll down a bit and click get started. Log in with your normal Paddy Pro details, so the stuff that you use to get into the Paddy Pro site or to edit dive guides or add your Paddy adventures. It's all the same login and all the same system. So I'll bring you to your Dive Centre homepage. This is just a test dive result for me to show you, but it should say your Dive Centre or Liverpool name on the left there. So just look on the left, scroll down to where it says Adventures and select Activity Listing. So here you can check what currency and make sure that that one's correct. So I'll leave that as US dollars for now. And then scroll all the way down to Product List. So to add a new product, click Add Product but I've already created this Women's Dive Day example, so I'm just going to click Edit the Listing. Glad to show you guys. So first things first, I'll bring you to the Basics tab. The most important thing to do is make sure you select Conservation Activity. So regardless of what your event is for Women's Dive Day, make sure you select Conservation Activity, because that's how we're going to make sure that it's actually going to show up on the Conservation Activities locator and not on the Paddy Adventures app. So select Conservation Activity. Then you can fill out whatever suits you best. So activity type, choose from the options, add the category, different options. Um, is it for a special event? Say so yeah, it's for Women's Dive Day. Uh, give it a title and then fill out some basic information about it in terms of how long it lasts, where you're gonna meet um, and how many people will be involved, the languages, if there's any minimum requirements like age or diver certification, and then select save. Then you want to add a description, so nothing too complicated, just add a couple of sentences about what it is you're going to be doing to give people the gist of, of why they should come and spend time on your Women's Dive Day activity. And then stick in a few highlights there, so I've just kept it real simple, come and celebrate Women's Dive Day, clean up the ocean and meet other women divers in our community. Keywords, add as many keywords as you want, I've just gone with Women's Dive Day and Dive Against Debris. Then it brings you on to your logistics tab. So I've said we're meeting at the dive centre, so it's also populated with that. But if you're meeting somewhere else, like at the dive boat or outside a shop, you can select other meeting point, and then you can use this map function to select where it is that you're going to meet. I'm going to keep it with dive centre address, but this meeting point description text box gives you another place to give additional information. For example, if you're going to have red t-shirts on, or you're going to be right next to a blue flag, stick that information in there and that'll help your divers find you. You click save again and now it'll bring you to the pictures and videos. So it's really important to have at least one picture or video. So it could be pictures of the marine life or the activity you're going to do or it could be your dive team smiling or last year's Women Dive Day event or even better a video if you did this event last year, uh, a wrap-up video from last year's event, anything to get divers excited to come and get involved with you because pictures and videos really speak a thousand words. So make sure you add at least one. You can upload a new picture. If you've already got pictures in your gallery, you can upload them here. Um, just be mindful if the pictures you're trying to upload are too small or too large, um, the system memorial will not allow you. So if you run into any trouble, just think how big is the picture here and see if you can resize it to more of a middle range size. So just click the copyright down here just to make sure that you have the rights to use that picture or videos and then click Finally, it's just about pricing and schedule. So if there's a price, stick the price in there. If there isn't any price, leave it at zero. Always select offline, you take the payment out of these two options. Even if there is no payment, just select offline. Stick in the date that is happening, which I assume is going to be July 16th for Women's Dive Day. Um, and then give a, give a, give a time. Um, and then the booking terms, and then there you are. So just click save. And then on the left, you come down here. I've already sent this one for review, but make sure you click a button down here that will say send for review. And all that means is the team will then review your um, listing and we'll set it live within a couple of days for divers to come and join your activity.